Hello, my name is Pranav, and today's topic is how to swap a table row table row in SQL Server. For that demonstration, uh, I just run this first query. Press F5. Check check my name and unique ID. My value is is swapping PNB to DSS. The rest of the value is not changing. I just Unique ID and name value is changing. Check here. Okay, press F5. Okay. For the for that, uh, I just uh, use simple logic. For that, I create a simple for the name. If I want to swap a name row, so I just create a simple uh, name uh, name name column. So I can store my temporary swapping value into the temp uh, temp column. For that, I use a count. In that count, here I run a simple command: select count is equal to count with bf table id from the temp bf table. So I just get here count. When I run here, when this command, I got a, a count number is four. Then I run a this while loop for the swapping the table. For the while here is i at the rate i is my variable and at that count is my variable so at the rate i say at that i is equal to one and here i got the number of rows in this table so if i one is less than equal to four this is true statement that it begins if i is equal to one at the rate i is equal to one means here i said all for for the first row my value is i is one so i one is equal to one it is value statement then Here's the count where my BF table ID is equal to four. So I just select four ID from table BF table. What I select? I select. I want to select a name whose ID is four. So I select BSS from. Uh, from the statement from that s from that sql query then else for the first loop this this select query is not working then the next statement next statement the run is this update query here i just write update tem bf update tem bf table say tem name bf tem name bf here is at in that column i just uh, save my record so i update this dss value last value into uh, into the tem name bf table so so set name uh, dss value where bf my ID number is equal to I. Here is my I value is one. So a last value stored into the first value. So first I do my first logic is I want to store my last no, last row into the my first row. So I got a first value here. So now my so so. Next time I want to swap my first value into second value, second value into third value. For that, after update command, uh, I increment the i value into one. So while loop runs again, two is less than equal to four. Right statement begin. If two is equal to one, not this is not a right statement. Else, then uh, after that. This command is run. Select update name. Select update name whose ID two minus one is one. So whose ID is one? So ID one is A. So I got this A. Sorry, I got A name from this uh, from that query. Then I update. This a name into a tem name bf. So I just want to update. Uh, where where to update this 
uh, name A. So I first I select a name PMBF is equal to add the rate update name where B F table ID is equal to two. So where I update this uh, update this name into temp name BF. So a value updated into into a second position so I just update my a value into two second here sorry for that my a value into second row so first time I update my last row into first I say first row into second this row the after that I increment one until the phi if condition is not wrong if condition is phi is less than equal to count then break the statement and run next command after running by left you got a uh, complete your swapping format but this swapping format stored in your same name bf uh, column but but this swapping format uh, store in your temporary table but do you want to uh, st store this value back again to your original name table because you want to this uh, original uh, swapping sorry your swapping uh, format into, do, into your original uh, column name so I just write a simple command update tame bf update tame bf set name here is my name is equal to tame name bf is equal to tame name bf and tame name bf is equal to name in this in that command to swap your name name into tame bf tame name bf column and tame name bf column into a name column uh, so sometimes your condition if you select on a button and even uh, and run this procedure your you can swap your tab tables row but sometimes you have to undo undo this command so for the undo event you can generate you can write the same update this undo command back to your original uh, original format this uh, update command it just give you a original uh, name column thank you for watching this video